Oh, motherfucker. Okay, go. You're on? Call it. That's a big one, dude. Is it? Yeah. Fish. You gotta you gotta yell it out loud. This guy's schooling me right now. Are you kidding me? If 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 it's on the if it's okay, come back, come down. It's a bigger one, man. It's a bigger one. <laughs> if it's on the bead that I think it is, I need to switch out myself. Let's go, Sean. Over here, all the way here. Right here. Follow me. Good. Make sure that rod tip is up, okay? Man, I'm just I'm Sean's net man today. I'm oh my gosh, I'm so happy for you. Keep the rod tip up. Yep. You're good. You're good. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. Yes, yes, yes. today on fire absolute fire oh my gosh you're good keep the rod tip up oh see what happens when you keep it too low let's see what did he break you off on the bottom bead i knew it okay i gotta switch that was good. i take that i take that any day <laughs> come on, let's retie so here here was the bead that caught Sean those fish back to back. I'm so happy that I did. I knew this was gonna get chomped on. This beautiful piece of work. This is the color. When you find the color, you hone in on it. You gotta, you gotta stick with it. My shoulder is burning, like my rear delt. How's your arm feel? So, this is fucking burning, bro. <laughs> that shit was big. Yeah, it was. See, when you find the color, we gotta. You gotta hone in on it. Now you know. Keep that rod tip yeah. up, cause that's the lowest it should I ever think be. Yeah, I put too much tension on it. When it was that, that low. Second. Yeah. Yeah. When it's that it low. Fucking broke. You're allowed to put that much tension on it when it's up high, cause it's the rod is bouncing and, and doing all the work, right? But when, when it's, it's low, down it's low, like, it's, it's all on here. No? It's gonna snap. Yeah. So you wanna use a rod? Okay. It's gonna snap. And you're battling it on four pound line too, so you gotta be careful. It's this light. This is five point six. Yeah. And then below it is four. Be mindful. Oh, you're on, you're on, you're on. Fish, call fish. You're on. Oh, beautiful. Come down here, Sean. Come down here, come down this way. Keep walking down. You're on. Let's go. Mission accomplished. Got my best bud finally hooked up to a fish. Now we gotta land him, come behind here, where the rock is. Down here, lift your rod tip high. Lift your, put a sideways slide on him. Come this way. You're good, you're good. Take your time. Take your time. Ooh. Take your time. He's on the did you see if he was on the top or bottom bead? Let him run, let him run, let him run. He's on the bottom. Four, four pound test. Come over here in the shallow. <laughs> let him run. That's that's a nice size. Keep that rod up. Keep the rod up. Don't 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 let it down too low, cause you want you want the rod to to bend. You let it down too low, it's gonna pull from the reel. Okay. Don't worry. Reel down on him. Reel down and then pull up slightly. Yeah. Nice. 
Up, 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 up. On the peach frosted bead, six millimeter. Top of the morning. Sean's first steelhead. Hopefully we land this bad boy. Get a nice photo of him. He's fighting. Don't let it don't let it load up on the reel, eh? Make sure. What do you what I do? Make sure that the rod tip is up. And then when he's not fighting, reel down on him and pull up slowly. See that? Let him run. Let him run. Higher, higher. Because if it's, if that's a bigger fish, he's gonna snap you off. More yeah. Lean back on it. Yeah, yeah. Look at him. Yeah, yeah, let him run, let him run. Don't forget, don't forget to let go of that reel when he runs. Do I still keep tension on it or do yeah. I just, uh, it's light, right? Light, yeah, really light. Beautiful fish. Nice head shakes. Nice little shaker. All right, take your time. Reel, reel down on him and then pull up. Pull, pull the rod this way. Pull the rod this way, towards me. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> Beautiful, Sean. Are you kidding me? Wow. You did it. My arm is fucking tired, bro. You did it. Beautiful fish, man. Congratulations. Did you snap off? No? Yes. Where? Hold on. Let's get this hook out. That was a fight. That was a fight, man. Imagine if that was a bigger fish. If you if you let it down, that rod, yeah. it's gonna load up on the reel and it's gonna snap your leader. Oh, so you gotta keep that rod tip up. Yeah. And when you don't feel like he's fighting, reel down and then slightly pull up. But that's when you're vulnerable, right? Cause you're letting your guard down and yeah. it, it could possibly do a big run and, and snap you too. So you gotta be careful. Six, 11 in the morning. Tell the people what you got, man. Got a fucking steelhead, bro. First one ever. It's a nice male. Just How we know it's a male? Because it has like a nice hook in its mouth there. The, yeah. the kite, that's what it's called. Let's take so a nice sweet. photo. Let's show it. Show it the fish out more. Yeah. Okay. Send her off, man. Good job, man. Let's get another one. Look, look how pretty he is. Jeez. Good yeah. job, man. Look. One, two, three, four, five, six. Flick it, thread it, stick it. Let's get back in there. There you go. Watch your rod tip. Oh, that was a fish. God damn. On the tangerine bead. How I know? Because it slid all the way down here. Wow. Yeah, you're still good. You got to take the weeds off there. Turn your rod tip that way if you're going to do maintenance. There you go. Wow, I can't believe I missed that fish. Got my eye off the float for a split second. Didn't see it and boom. Should have whacked it a bit harder. Amateur hour right now. Oh, fish! And of course my center pin knob comes off like, oh my gosh. Oh, I got whacked. I got whacked super hard on that one. Uh, I think I got him wrapped.
Don't worry, you keep fishing. I'll, I'll, don't worry, it's good. <sighs> Fish gods are really making me grind out for this one. Really making me grind out for this one. Okay, so, back to business. Here's the bead that he smacked me on, back to back. And if we get back in there, I guarantee you guys that we'll hook into another one. Size 10 hook. One, two, three, four, five, six. So what I got going on, I got a glass bead on top, trailered by plastic clear peach bead. And what that presentation does is the glass bead sink into the bottom first, accompanied by plastic bead trailering right behind it, floating a little bit above the water column of where the glass bead is. So ideally, if that's what you want, and you run two glass beads at the same time, maybe on deeper waters, let's go. And if we hook up to another one, back to back, that would be incredible. But now I only have one handle. So this is going to be a challenge because this doesn't spin properly. It kind of hesitates and then comes. But it'll be fun. It's a good spot. It's going to catch the drift. Really good spot. Oh, yeah. Wait, wait. Oh, there you go, buddy. Now we're drifting. Oh, let's go again. Let's see what beat it got. Beautiful. Come on. This guy is putting on a clinic. I teach you how to. Ooh, hoo, hoo. I teach you how to steal that fish. And this is what. <laughs> you just have to get the biggest one in the pool. Keep that rod tip up, right? Make sure you let him run. Keep that rod tip up. Higher. Yeah. It doesn't go any lower. Real? Real down? Okay, stop. Now heave up. Yep. Just let him fight. Let him fight it out. Beautiful fish. I feel like your guide right now. This is awesome. Even though I'm not hooked up. See that you're hooked up, Sean? Is everything. I'm so happy. Start making your... Uh, when, he, when he comes back down this way, start making your way down. Right after we switched to a chartreuse frosted. You know what I mean? Every time I switch out. Come this way. Point your rod left. Guide him, guide him. Let him, let him fight. Is he over here? Okay, just, just let him fight. Maybe we can scoop him here. If not, it's gonna come down this way. Start guiding him this way a little bit. A little bit, yeah. This guy putting on a clinic. I'm so proud of you, man. Good job. It's a big I'm fish, tired. buddy. That's a big fish. Big. Eight pound. This is your pool. Take your time. It's no rush. Let him. You're doing good. He's he's gonna start start angling your rod towards your left. Maybe he might want to nudge that way. Keep your rod tip higher though. Yeah. He's chilling there. He's just gonna tire himself out. We gotta bring this one in, though. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I teach my cousin how to steelhead fish. He's out fishing me, Raymond. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Your cousin? My cousin, yeah. Okay, he's, he's coming out. You wanna start guiding him to the left. Start putting some side. Oh, yeah. Here, here he comes. He's right here, right by our feet. Here we go. Okay, let's start moving. Careful, careful, take it easy, take it easy. Take it easy, you're good. You're good. You're good. Make your way. Keep the rods up higher. Yep. It's all in your fingers, remember. It's all in your fingers. Take your time with this boy. Big fish. Go all the way out over there. Back, back, back. Put a sideways fight him that way. 
Let's go. Third fish. <laughs> you want to be a bit higher because if he if he runs on yeah if he stops moving and you feel it reel down a bit and start pulling up a little bit that's how you fight a steelhead yeah there you go good good that's as low as you go that's a big fish buddy got a second wind bro you're doing good just keep it up. Keep it up. I'm gonna come in when he comes over here a bit more. That you gotta keep that rod tip up if you want this fish to come in. Reel down a bit. Okay. Heave on him a little bit. Not too much pressure when you're down there, okay? <laughs> Ooh, man. Every time we change a color on your setup, you get you hook up. Higher, higher, higher. Keep it high. <laughs> higher, higher. Okay, real. Okay. Wait, wait. He's let it. Let him. Let him run. Let him run. Coaching right now, man. This is so intense. I hope you guys feel the intensity. Don't let it go any lower than that. Higher. Yeah. Stay there. Here he comes. Here he comes. Oh, yes, top bead, Sean, top bead. Orange bead. Get in the mouth. Bro. Orange bead. Get it. Get I can't, it. I can't. You gotta bring him in more. You gotta bring him in more. That's a big head. <laughs> That's a big head. Oh my god, Sean. Are you serious? That's a big hand, dude. <laughs> bro, my arm is tired. Oh my god. Fuck. Beautiful, look at that. See that? Top bead? Oh my Sean, this is the beautiful most beautiful hen I've ever seen in my life, man. A big girl, bro. She's a big, big girl, man. Let's get this hook out of her mouth. See look at that. Right there. Bottom jaw. There's uh, there's a previous hook in her too, a red one. Dude, come on, look at that, buddy. I'm so proud of you. Let's get this hook out of you, big girl. Look at that red hook in her. Let's put her upstream so she could breathe in the water. Congratulations, man. That's a big hand, man. This is awesome. Teaching Sean, guiding my best friend how to catch a fish. Let's walk us through this, man. Tell, tell, tell us what you went through, what you experienced just now. What happened, man? Get down on your knee, dude. Suck that bobber down real quick, fast. I set the hook, I fell off the thing. Now I'm bleeding. <laughs> Was it worth but it? It's worth it, bro, for this big yeah. one. Let's take a picture, man. Holy shit. Man. I hope they hear. Cradle her. Don't forget to cradle her. Holy shit. Angle her head more towards me, yeah. A little less. A little bit. Tuck your fingers down to her towards her belly more. Yeah. That's a big fish. Holy shit. Are you gonna keep her? Her the eggs? I don't think she has eggs in her, man. She's she might be spawned skinny. out. Yeah. There's another hook in her butt too. Let's take this hook out. Hold on. Let's see. Put her back in here for a sec. Let's see if there's even eggs in here. Dude, you're freaking slaying it, buddy. Needle her, put her towards the current here. Let's see her. Oh, yeah. Yep. Good. There you go. Thank you for the 
the fight. How incredible was that? Where do I start? That, oh my God, that fish was just, that was a big female. And if you guys saw that, she went for that tangerine, frosted tangerine bead. Every time I re-rig Sean on a new rig, he just seems to hook up to a, another fish. So that was the one it was chomped on. The two previous ones were on this one. We haven't yet caught one on this lighter orange, but hopefully we do. So at least we know, boom, boom, those are out. Hopefully you get one on this one and we get one on the yellow one as well. So oh. let's get back in there, we man. Have. And you know how bad they get. Fish gods, if you hear me, I just want to catch a fish and land one, please. Oh yeah, there we go, yeah. Oh, wow. Going real, real light with the leader. I gotta be extra, extra careful. That's a big fish. Yeah, Lily paid to the fish guys over this dog. I heard you. <laughs> I gotta be careful. I got a light, light line. 3.3 pound. Sorry, Raymond. No, no oh, yeah. Doubled up. Two for one special. Two for one special. Maybe we could net him. He's trying to get that snag. Big one. A big girl, bro. Nice fish. Beautiful. First one. Wow, pretty girl. Two lamprey marks on the tail here. Make sure you scoop her head first, all right? She's tired. Coming to you. Oh, yeah. Oh, buddy. There it is. Beautiful, beautiful head. Oh my gosh. So I want to show you guys what this beautiful hen ended up taking. Here we go. Here's what she ended up taking. <laughs> this bead and this bead close together because I was running a spawn sack below. So it, it, she ended up taking this conjunction here. Here she is. And we're gonna go for a release. Beautiful, healthy. Apparently there is. You just gotta find it. This, like, this is just one of them. Like you go down further over there, there's like a couple S-bends. And uh, yeah, it's pretty good out there too. But um, I haven't tried it yet. I know where it is. We just gotta find it. Well, that's it for today. Oh, the R hole. Hold on, a whole lot of nonsense happens here. You lose more fish than you catch fish. Mission accomplished. We got Sean to land his first ever steelheads. I am so happy about that. We did it, Joe. We fucking did it.